what's the meaning of this whole thing? What's the meaning of life? Now, you're not allowed to say, I don't know. Okay. Um, you can uh, be just like your dad and say, let me just give my two cents. <laughs> take, take it for you. Whatever it's worth, take it or leave it. It's probably worth nothing. It's pit, piddle on the ground. Um, uh, <laughs> Do you, I mean, what, what? why are we here? Is it, it's just busily creating all these kinds of things, worrying about things, having kids. I... My purpose, at least right now, is to wake up and try to bring light love to the world, light love to myself, and have integrity. That's my purpose. Um, the ultimate purpose of life that I guess that's my ultimate purpose of life. I, I I don't know what happens when I die. Ayahuasca gave me some sense that there's more to be known. I'm sure there are other things in life that would give me that. That I'm and I'm lurk, I'm looking for it. I'm a seeker. Like I'm I'm always looking for the next something to give me hope in something more. Even if so, I could just not bullshit my kids when they ask me that question and be like, you know what? I really don't know. I, th I, I want to not know more, if that makes sense. I don't want to, like, I want to see things that make me confused, that make me question what I already knew. Like, I am, uh, like, when I meet an atheist who comes up to me and they're like, atheism, 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 it's just as laughable to me as when I meet the Mormon who comes up and they're like, Mormonism, Mormonism, Mormonism. I'm like, how do, how do anyone... How do you guys know? Did like, like, and I, you know. So you feel like you're doing some, through all your travels, through all the people you meet, you feel like you're still keeping your eyes open and your heart open to sort of discover, discover something new, like the ayahuasca experience, that there might be, there might be deeper truths out there. Yeah. And, and I want to find them and I want to surround myself with people who are just looking for it. I'm not, I'm not interested in people who are just looking to point fingers at each. Like I, life is so short. I'm looking for, it's one of the reasons that I want to meet with you is I was like, wow, Lex really seems like he's on a journey to find truth. And that <laughs> humility for me is same thing with Rick. It drew me to Rick. It was like, I really, I, I see that and I identify with it. And that's what I'm looking for. There's the final song on our record, our new record that's coming out. The chorus goes, um, and this is like th this is my best answer to to what to what you're asking. Um, the chorus goes, "Take it easy on me, I need some lullaby. They tell me heaven's just a lie. Well, I'm not surprised. Tell me that you know, no, you don't. Yeah, you're just like me. Can we just all hope for the best?" Take it easy. So that's it for me. It's like I, I'm in a place in life where I'm like, I don't know. Tell me, you know, I don't. I'm not gonna believe you. Maybe you do. I, I'm not gonna believe it. But like, let's just be easier on each other and like try to find truth wherever it may lie. But above all, know that we don't know jack shit. I think that's a mic drop moment, Dan. Thank you so much. You're an incredible human. I love that you share with the world the darkness of your mind, of your life experience and the, and the beautiful light that you've shown to the world. So uh, it's a huge honor and thank you for spending your valuable time. Good luck on the tour. Thanks, man. Thanks for having me.